What's up, guys? We're back on Cold War Zombies, and today we're going to be getting the DMR Dark Aether. Now, we're getting close to getting every weapon in the game Dark Aether. I think we have this, the KSP, and maybe something else I can't remember, but we're coming down to the wire here. Anyways, here's the attachments I'm using for the DMR. I'm using the Cobra Red Dot, SOCOM Eliminator, Strike Team Barrel for that faster fire rate and the boosted damage, Ember Sighting Point, Bruiser Grip, 35 Round Fast Mag, Serpent Wrap, and the SAS Combat Stock. And really quick, checking out my camo progress, I have actually a decent bit done 250 kills nothing too crazy but it's a good head start so we still need to work on our grunge liquid and brush stroke camos we're basically done with everything else besides fauna which is 10 kills rapidly and we need a few more jackrabbits as well so i think we can get this all done pretty easily in one game and we're also going to be able to see how this thing does against orda because we're hopping right back onto firebase c all right here we go one's gonna go ahead and drop us off all right and we're gonna waste no time i'm going straight for the rampage inducer we're gonna get this thing underway we're speed running today just got a really make sure i get my crits though with these super sprinters last time it didn't work out so well for me we died twice on round 13 with the lc10 this time things are gonna be different oh they're already on me pop open the door i kind of want to go straight to kernels oh there we go we already got a camo a rising tiger and we're already on round four these are flying by you know what we're gonna do it a little out of order i'm going for this one first let's get this reactor going good thing this dmr has like a decent fire rate if this thing was a single shot with rampage mode, I would be dead already. Okay, one more kill, and that should be the reactor. There we go. Easy. Okay, now we can go to the Pex reactor. Shut up, Pack. Pop it open. Hit the rail. That was decent. All right, zombies, where you at? There they are. Hey, we got another camo. Already making our way through. Hey, you put that down. How are these zombies tanking headshots? This thing doesn't one-shot kill on round five. It literally leaves them with one health. That's kind of annoying. But we do have the second reactor done. Let's go get the third one. Even though with rampage mode, we get the reactors on like a few rounds later than we normally would, it feels like it goes by so much faster. All right, last reactor started. Oh, an insta-kill. This thing actually needs it. Let me grab that. Oh, and our grudge camo. Ooh, get collated. And the reactors are done easy so now i think until we get our assault wave round i'm gonna go sit in kernels because there's not really a, a point in risking going down by the pack punch machine for like the fifth time so i'm going straight to kernels now, i had somebody comment and say it's disrespectful to be giving these guys kisses so i'm not going to be doing that it's like it's kind of scary being here with super sprinters oh but it's so nice for camos it's so easy i for sure need dead shot with this thing it does not do enough damage to the head there we go. Contamination camo. We're getting our jackrabbit medals in. We're already on round nine. This has gone by so fast. It's actually so much easier now. Now that I have a little bit of experience with using the rampage inducer, I kind of know what to look out for. This kind of chill. It's literally like speed running to Orta. Now it's kind of nice with this because you can pop your ring of fire. And even if like the round ends, you clear the round too fast, something like that. The ring of fire will probably still be here by the time the next round starts because these waves just are so extremely fast unless the last zombie's just taking its time which seems to always be happening to me where is it it says it's all the way over here why are you spawning all the way over there stop that oh come on reload oh wait they're so far away easy racking up camos racking up crits that's all we do here this thing is actually not oh my god i was about to say it's not that bad and i'm going down <sighs> i always jinx myself somehow i don't know how that happens i say one thing and it's like it's like the game hears me what i guess this thing is kind of bad i was gonna say the only downside to it is that it doesn't like one shot headshot i'm sure it will once i pack a punch it and all that We're kind of disappointing that it started to fall off at like round five. Oh, mimic ring of fire no way i'm already dead i just have a reputation of dying at round 13 and 12. this is ridiculous i felt like i was doing well too literally the second i opened my mouth and said this is easy this gun's doing well dead all right retry i don't want to hear a peep out of you just drive good thing about the rampage inducer is that these rounds will just go by fast so let's just do it again i'm doing this one first this time grind the rail and it's already done easy holy zombies they're all flooding in another reactor done though grind this rail i completely missed it off the rail grind the other one missed it damn finally back to the last reactor and that is the last reactor get out of here all right, back in kernels. Let's just survive this time. Okay, now I'm not gonna be shy about using my ring of fire. Anytime I have it, I'm popping it. Got another camo down. Give me that max ammo. Sir, leave me alone. Oh, zombies! 
Back up. Okay, I'm not dying on round 12. I'm not dying on round 13. We're making it through the whole thing this time. No messing around. Actually, we have one zombie left. I'm not making the same mistake as last time. Okay, maybe two zombies left. We're not making the same mistake as last time. I'm not gonna go down without a pack a punch weapon. I'm just gonna go pack it, even double pack it. Maybe I'll pack and then grab a few perks. I think that sounds like a good deal. Stop grabbing off. Give me that. Give me this. Give me this loose change. I'm grabbing jug, depth perception, speed cola, and dead shot. We're also gonna get stamina up. And now we're going back to kernels. Okay, now we're cooking with this thing. We should be safe in here. Knock on wood, though. Everybody knock on wood right now. Boundary camo, let's go. Oh, double points and a max ammo. We need both of those. Still no assault wave. We're on round 13. I've been getting a lot of late assault waves recently. We do not get here at round 10 anymore. It's not for me. We made it to 14. We made it past the round 13 curse. We made it passed the round 12 curse. I think we'll be fine from here. Hopefully. There's our assault wave. It's gonna be easy. Oh wait, I'm running the wrong way. Wait, is this a DMR? Dang, if only I knew, I could've just came out here and bought a upgraded one easily. I guess we'll take a free cruise missile. All right, which one are they coming through? This one. Let's rack up a few crits from back here, from downtown. Uh oh, there's a lot coming. Got a ring of fire. Oh, a little boy crawling at me. Domed. Oh, he's the last one. Jeez, the run literally just ended. They're already here. They're so fast. Oh, I need my ring of fire soon. I have to stun here so I have time to reload. Perfect. We're making it through. Okay, we can survive without a ring of fire for a second. Oh no, there's a mimic and super sprinters. We might have to ring of fire. We're ring of firing now. Why is it making me reload my ring of fire? I hate it when that happens. Got a downfall camo. It's getting really chaotic. Holy shit. This is insane. Okay. It, things have calmed down a little bit. Okay, it looks like there's one zombie left and he's taking his time getting over here. So I'm going to go pack a punch again. Oh, Mimic, fuck off. How about that one? Okay, let's get pack a punch two. Uh, we're gonna get meal kick, quick revive, and that's all we need for right now. I completely forgot to show what the DMR looked like with pack a punch one. I guess I'll have to show pack a punch two after this round if I get like two seconds. This shit gets so intense, it's so easy to forget to do things. But the pack a punch one camo isn't that great, so you didn't miss out on much. Take another quick look at it. Oh. Yep, that's what I wanted to do. Okay, now this is what it looks like. Pretty solid. Pretty good coverage on the gun. I like it a lot, actually. Very clean. We got two more rounds of this. We got to do this round and finish next round, and then we're all done with our rampage inducer. Holy shit. If we'll survive for that long, another bloodshed camo. Already have 1,500 kills with this? What? Any other zombies want to walk in my crosshair? There you go. Next and gone. Oh, we do get our second assault wave. Seems like the first one always comes late, and then the second one is right on the money at 20. Bars. But while we have a whole 30 seconds here, I'm gonna get pack three. There we go. There's pack punch three. Let me upgrade our weapon. Let's get it green, blue, purple, and we can upgrade our armor to level two. Really quick, this is what it looks like with pack punch three. Very crisp. Very clean. I really like this camo a lot. But I hope when the new map comes out, we have new pack a punch camos, even newer than Mauer. Uh oh. They're already on the unit. I'll show them a unit. Let's get this over with, shall we? Shut up, Peck. I'm on a mission. This is actually taking so much damage right now. I'm so late to the party over here. Look, they're already coming to find me. Hey, leave that thing alone down there, you three. And these sentry turrets are so useless, I couldn't even kill the three zombies that were on it that whole time. Where's the last zombie at? Oh no, there's still more waves. Holy shit. Come on, zombies. Feed me those crits. Oh, wait, there's one behind. Wait, who's hitting me? Oh, it's a crawler. Jeez. Crawlers are so sneaky. Any more waves coming in? Oh, no, just a few crawlers. Bam. Come here, pal. Bonk. Oh, and the rampage inducer is done. We survived it. Took us two tries this time instead of three. I call that a W. Along with this... Ra I was going to say along with this rail grind, but we fucked that one up too. Literally dropped a max ammo right after an assault wave. It's got to be programmed in. That was literally the first zombie that I killed. They just troll with those max ammos. The zombies are so slow now that they turned on baby mode. Oh, I almost forgot to do it this game. Sorry, boys. Mangler, not today. I've got time for you. Camo grinding has gotten so easy at this point. Like, I almost have every single gun in the game done. And most of it has just been sitting in this spot, tapping. This is the most goaded spot in the world. I feel like I'm getting a lot of crits. Let's check. 844 out of 940. Not bad at all, actually. We're 100 behind, but we're on round 24. So it's bound to start to catch up to us. But not a bad ratio at all. I wish maybe instead of having, like, a second rampage inducer for these later rounds, they would just have... 
something where like the rounds start a little faster because the time in between rounds is so slow compared to when we had the rampage inducer on and that stuff adds up when you're trying to go to like round 40 or whatever which is usually around the amount of rounds it takes to get something gold viper this is the one time i wish there was like mounting in this game it would keep my crosshair so level probably would not have to move it at all in here so i hope when vanguard zombies comes out in if there is camos for vanguard zombies but there's a spot kind of like kernels and then we can just mount up and sit there and grind camos out so easy i've had a lot of people asking recently what's the best way to grind camos in this game and it's literally just this staying here shoot forward easy but also we have 1500 crits now this mangler really gotta stop getting stuck or a step mangler is gonna come and get him oh there's our drench camo our pack a punch kills are at 1500 also can i just say how goaded mule kick tier 5 is i have not had to buy ammo like since getting that upgrade it just increases the the chances of zombies dropping ammo by so much that i'm like always full on ammo after every round and there's like actually extra to spare on the ground oh there we go round 30 baby where's orda but well, first i'm gonna upgrade my weapon fully so we can see what this thing can do against orda with its full potential so there's legendary i'll grab tier 3 armor as well we have our ring of fire ready and i actually don't really know how this thing's gonna do against them because this thing was kind of iffy at it round five now that this thing's fully upgraded it's kind of killing faster i don't know I guess we're gonna have to see. Come on in, Orda. The water's fine. You can dodge me an outbreak all you want, but you're required to be here on round 30. Ooh. Decent amount of damage. It's actually done quite a bit. I'm hitting my ring of fire already. Ooh! Almost 3,000 damage per shot. That's not bad. He's already at half health. Let's take him out before the zombies start getting over here. Holy shit, he's already at a quarter health. Oh yeah, scream, Orda. It'll be all be over soon. Oh, ring of fire ended. Oh yeah, give me the crit spot and it's already over. I thought zombies hardly even made it to me before he died. This thing destroys Orda. This thing shredded him so easily. Look at that. Not even close to stepping foot in here. That was probably the fastest assault wave I've ever done. Jeez, this thing is a sleeper against Orda. Now it's back to the grind. It's still such a shame that you can't really clap more than like two or three zombies at a time. So it'd be so nice sitting up here just collating an entire line of zombies. Camos would get done so quick. That's a very small feature I want to see added to Vanguard. Just snipers collating zombies just more. All right, I'm going to sit right here and I'm going to keep my hand off my keyboard except to hit my field upgrade. I'm going to try to go as long as I can without moving. Maybe I can also hit my keyboard to reload. I think that's fair. But no movement. I got a ring of fire. Still have not moved. Those are rotten camo. We're done with all of our normal kills. The DMR is actually kind of nice. It's growing on me. At the start, it seemed like almost like it was going to be a, a, a very difficult grind based on it not killing at round five. But now that it's fully upgraded and fully pack-a-punched, and the way I just saw it desecrate Orda, this thing's kind of a beast. And you can control how fast you want to shoot it. It's just perfect. See, there's a there's a double points right here, but I'm not going to go get it because I'm not moving. No, sir. My ring of fire since everything got close. Mangler kind of knocked me over to the side there. It's getting a little intense. Uh-oh. Okay, I'm going to have to throw a stun. I'm moving back, getting into the center. Very slight movement. Oh, no. I think that mimics in slow motion. Yeah, I keep ending up like all the way in this corner somehow. Oh, lots of zombies. Hello. Okay. Our no move experiment is over. It's just so weird playing with one hand. We're already on round 35. These rounds are flying by if I just don't leave this room. I feel like every time I run out there to grab all that salvage, I'm just messing the spawns up and zombies are spawning on the other side of the wall over near the portal. And it's just taking forever th for them to cross the bridge. If I just stay in here, spawns are crisp. Stun. Let me reload, please. Thank you. I need another stun. You're where it's way too close to me. And there's our ring of fire. Dang, this thing's a monster. Don't drop armor for me, buddy. Huh? Drop a little armor. Nope. Whoa, look at the points. 169,000. Shout out, sex. Jeez, I'm doing like 15, 16,000 per shot now. More than that, actually. That's like 100,000. Oh, I'm going to need a stun here. Come on, reload. Gonna need another stun. Another one, because we don't have a ring of fire yet. Max ammo, perfect. Oh, another stun. They're getting so close. Ring of fire. I have no idea how we're surviving this. Not a fucking clue. I don't even, I can't even see what's going on. I think that was my most hectic round yet. Oh, there's our chemical camo. We got to be getting close on crits too. That means we are completely done with pack-a-punch kills. We get crits done before Ardo shows up again? Round 39. We're getting close. Need another stun so I can reload. Uh-oh, I have one more stun left, but we have a ring of fire. 
We save that stun for next round. If if we make it to the next round. Jeez. Oh, there's Gold Viper. We did it. We beat it before Orda. All right, let's see how long we can survive in here. We only got one stun left. No ring of fire. Can we keep it moving? Uh-oh. I'm surrounded. Ah! Holy shit, I'm still making it out. Oh my god. An insta-kill? Oh! No, you're so close. Oh, wait. Quick revive. I'm literally just going to lay down on the trigger. I'm going as hard as I possibly can right now. Oof. It is insane how long we survived there with all those zombies around us. We might as well take out Orda. He's already here. We're not going to leave. We don't have our perks, though. I think we should be fine. I'll just buy what I can on the way there. I already passed by Jug, though, which is a problem. Let's get stamina up. We even have the perfect spawn for it. Come on. Too easy. That shot is going to hurt us a little bit, not having that. We'll be good. Come on, Orda. And go. Still doing pretty decent damage even without that shot. 3,000 per shot. Oh, we're chunking the fuck out of his health. Come here, Orda. Come get some. How am I doing less damage now? He got closer to I'm doing less damage. How does that make sense? Go ahead and scream. So many zombies are inside. Nade. Oh, not now. His crit spot's open. We're hitting our cruise missile. Let's take out all these zombies to give us time. Get Orda all to ourselves. Oh, they're all here. Throw the nade and jump down. We have an artillery strike too. Okay, I'm just putting it down and I'm running back inside. Ooh, easy kills artillery strike. Get him. We'll shoot him from in here. It's not often that we kill Orta twice, so I'm trying to get him back. Oh, we have another ring of fire. Let's get it. Oh, he's so low. Come on. Oh yeah, show me that crit spot. 9,000 damage each hit. You're done. Go to bed. Let's hit these guys with the nade and watch them crumble. Goodbye, Orta. Hey. Jeez, I got hit by a ghost. But the DMR has surprised me a lot. This thing is way better than I thought it was going to be. Not only does it shred Orta, but we actually survive for so long in kernels without having to leave. Usually at around round 35, we need like elemental pop so we can like electric cherry our way out of bad situations. But this thing, it, it's a survivor. But now we got to hit the X-Fill. I'm going to grab a cashmere device, more Semtexes, and let's go X-Fill. We're even doing it without full perks. That's how confident I am in this gun. Okay, maybe not that confident. Mimic? No. Bad Mimic. Cashmere device, go! Okay, now we're out here. Here's an idea. I'm gonna throw one right there. Am my ring of fire? And just go as ham as possible. Only 12 left. Come on. Where are the rest of them? Oh, they're tanking shots. No. Leave me alone. Nade. Last guy. Let's get him low. I got, I got something special for you, pal. Going up here. Where'd he go? Right there. Oh, I missed every shot. You know what? I'm getting you the old fashioned way. Let's get out of here. Come here, Raptor one. It's been a while since we've actually X filled. Normally we, we finished not on an X fill round, but that time we finished right when order showed up. We got to take them out one more time, get the X fill. Oh, and 2069 crits. You know what I'm going to say? You know what? You guys say it. And we only went down once. Now let's go ahead and see what this thing looks like with the Zombies Master camos really quick. Here is Gold Viper. I really do not like this camo. So now we're on to Plague Diamond. That is crisp. I like that a lot. Like diamond's so clean. I do just, I just don't use it enough. And dark aether is actually a lot nicer than I thought it was going to be. Let's go ahead and hop in game and see what it looks like in there. All right. This is what the DMR looks like in game with dark aether. This is so clean. The secondary color on this, when they put the, the black metal on this, usually doesn't look as good as this. I guess I haven't really seen it up close as much, but it's so nice. This is a really crisp weapon, but I'm going to have to end the video there. If you guys like this and you want to see more, go ahead and leave a like on it. If you didn't, you don't dislike. If you're new here, please consider subscribing, put out all kinds of COD content throughout the week. And that's going to be it for me today. I'll see you guys next time. Later.